What's up, guys? I uh, got another Tavor Tavor. Not sure how you pronounce it, but their uh, monthly monthly beer delivery service. And uh, this is this month's little beer haul. So let's see what we got. Cause I forgot what I ordered. These are always packaged really well. I've never had anything broken, so knock on wood, knock on cardboard. Uh, all right, let's see. Got two cans of oh, Woohoo! Double IPA from uh, Three Magship Brewery. I've had some of their beer before and a different IPA, uh, and it was very good. And this is 8.5, Three Magnus Brewing, my bad. <laughs> Three Magnus Brewing. Um, and uh, yeah, 8.5%. All right, oh, so I gotta keep in mind to not place that down so hard because I'm sure it might clip in your ear, especially these glass. This is a uh, Big Sur double IPA, brewed and bottled by Barrel House Brewing from California, 9.6%. A big guy. I where three magnets is from. Three magnets might be from. I don't know. I, oh, Olympia, so Washington. Cool. Yeah, these come from like all over. Sometimes, uh, I guess stuff from Alaska um, and everywhere. Usually just from the U.S. Mostly from the West Coast, the Western area. Uh, this is Critical Thinking Imperial Stouts from Stillwater Artisanal uh, Pint and it doesn't say what percentage it is but uh, yeah last time I got like nothing but IPAs and so I wanted to switch up and get a lot of stouts so kind of a little marble design. Kind of looks like a Converge album cover or something. <laughs> but, uh, excited to drink some stouts. Alright, we got El Segundo Blurred Lines Hybrid IPA. 7.7%. And they're from, uh, I don't know. It's a West Coast IPA. I'm not sure where they're from. California. El Segundo, California. Uh, last time I had one of their beers, it was a Stone Cold Steve Austin beer. <laughs> and it was actually really good, surprisingly. I figured it'd just be something you put his name on, yeah, but uh, it was actually really good. This one, the Lost Abbey. I really like the stuff from Lost Abbey. And this is Serpent Stout, Imperial Stout. It's a big boy. It's really cool. Got Adam and Eve being all naked. from San Marcos, California. Yeah, I've had uh, a good bit of stuff from Lost Abbey before, and it's always really good. Here, we got from Odd 13 Brewing, Duras, Duras no, no Door, Duras no Door, Sour Ale, Peach and Apricot. So you got a sour and peach sour. Um, and it's 4.5%, so pretty low. It's from Colorado. I was really bummed I missed out on um, one from Odd 13 Brewing. It was like uh, Danny DeVito as a troll from like Always Sunny, but like a cartoon version of it. Uh, it was really awesome, it was really funny, and I wanted to get it, but it sold out like immediately. Uh, so I was bummed I missed out on that. This was uh, Dank and Sticky <laughs> IPA from uh, The Hop Concept, 8.5%. San Marcos, California. It's another one from San Marcos. Got two cans of that. That dank. Dank and sticky. Sticky. Alright, so next. Monkless Belgian Ales. I've had uh, some other stuff from Monkless. And it's from Oregon. And this is the Scheplikofagen Belgian style wheat beer. Brewed with spices. And it's 5.4%, so kind of an average, average alcohol content there. 
We got another Odd 13 Brewing. Uh, code name Superfan. That's cool. There's a little superhero dude on there. Like he's wrestling the void. That's from Lafayette, California, 6.5%. Oh, another uh, Imperial India Pale Ale uh, Mega Dank from Heathen Brewing. I got this last time, and uh, they might have gave me one for free or by accident. <laughs> uh, but uh, it was really good, and it's 9.3%, and it's a, a big one. So I'm looking forward to drinking that again. That's awesome. Wasn't expecting that. I got two cans of A Place to Stand IPA. Mixtape series from Boise, Idaho. And I'm not sure of the brewery name. Could be Mandarina, Monroe, Mosaic. I don't think so. That's probably like their slogan or something. Unless I'm mistaken. No, it's Independent Craft Brewery. Alright. 6.7%. But uh, nice, nice design on there. Looks pretty swell. All right. This one's Malibu Nights Double IPA, brewed with tangerines and hibiscus. Eight point eight percent from Champion Brewing Company. Champion Brewing Company. It's like a nice Vice City kind of kind of feel to it. I dig it. Next, got another big one. Raspberry at Sea from Pelican Brewing from Oregon with raspberries. Nine percent. Small batch series. That's cool. Bet this would be real good. Nice red ale. Raspberry red ale. Alright, so that's, that's done. Brickside. Limited edition, air to excess. Bourbon barrel aged stout, brewed with sea salt, caramel, hazelnuts, and chocolate. 10%. So, I'm excited for this one. From Brickside Brewery. From Oregon, Portland. Pretty basic, nice little gold foil there. But I bet it tastes real good. Got another big boy. Port Brewing Company, 12th Anniversary Double IPA. So I did end up getting uh, a lot of IPAs. 10.5% from San Marcos, California. Another one from San Marcos. Uh, yeah, I really tried to order more stouts, but they seem to offer more IPAs uh, recently, which is fine, because I really like IPAs, but I uh, just want some more variety, you know? That's why I got sour in there and whatever they're trying to throw at me. And got East Coast Transplant, Vermont style double IPA, New Image Brewing. 8.5%. little summer brew. If you're hearing pugs again, the older pug here. The one you guys seen more often is this one, the little troublemaker. <laughs> That's the typewriter toes you hear. Alright, and this is the last one. Imperial Stout 1850 from Keys Brewery. 12.4%. So, yeah, nice imperial stout. Some little heavier. Might save that for last. All right, and uh, that's it. Uh, all right, yeah, I'll probably leave my uh, recommendation, like, 
number or whatever they give you on your profile when you sign up. But if you haven't signed up before, um, they'll give you like, I think 10% off your first order. And I think I get 10% off of like my total. So that's pretty cool. So I'll leave that down in the uh, description. And if you do sign up, you know, to uh, the Tavor app, it's a free app, but I mean, you know, it's a flat $15 uh, shipping charge. So I usually like to order like a bunch and get a, a pretty good rate. Um, and uh, yeah, that's it. So, you know, if you're new, type in my number, get 10% off. I get 10% off. Love goes around, right? All right, peace.